In a virtual memory system, the size of the virtual address is 32 bits. Size of the physical address is 30 bits. Page size is 4 kilobytes and size of each page table entry is 32 bits. The main memory is byte addressable. That means each byte is having an address. What is the maximum number of bits that can be used for storing protection and other information in each page table entry? So we are given that the page size, which is also equal to the page frame size is 4 kilobytes. And so if we expand this into bytes, this is 4 into 2 to the power of 10 bytes, which is 2 to the power of 12 bytes. We are also given that the physical address space is of 30 bits. That means it is the address is 30 bits. That means the total physical address space is 2 to the power of 30 bytes. So how many number of page frames will be there in the physical space? Whatever is the total space divided by the page frame size. So 2 to the power of 30 divided by 2 to the power of 12, there will be 2 to the power of 18 page frames in the physical memory. So if this is the RAM or the physical memory, we will have page frame 0, page frame 1, then page frame 2 to the power of 18 minus 1 because it is starting from 0. So if we want to specify the page frame in the page table, there are 2 to the power of 18 frames. So to specify the page frame, we will need 18 bits for in, to specify the frame number in the page table. It's also given that the length of the virtual address is 32 bits. So that means the virtual address space or the logical address space would be 2 to the power of 32 bytes. Now in the virtual address space, we have pages. So whatever is the total virtual address space divided by the page size, which we saw was given as 2 to the power of 12 or 4 kilobytes. This gives us 2 to the power of 20 number of pages in the virtual address space. So if there are these many pages, that means these many entries will be required in the page table. So there will be 2 to the power of 20 entries in the page table. So if this is the page table, we will have an entry for page 0, we will have an entry for page 1, page 2 and so on. And then we will have an entry for page 2 to the power of 20 minus 1. Now each entry in the page table will contain the frame bits and the protection and the other information bits. We have just calculated that the number of bits required for the frame bits is 18. And it's also given that each entry in this page table is of 32 bits. So how many bits can be used for protection and other information? 32 minus 18, which is 40. So 14 bits can be used for storing protection or other information.